Yo, yo. What's up, y'all? It's time to jump back up to these Patreons, baby. Let's keep them coming, baby. Up next, we got another one from Mr. Daniel Williams. Uh, he wanted me to check out Beyond the Embrace. So uh, that's what we're about to get into, Mr. Daniel Williams. This is for you, homie. Come on. Right to the next song. Change this right to the next song. Let's go. guys great album <sighs> what's this is this like a interlude of some sort hey i'm gonna skip this <laughs>
This album's nice. Yeah, guys. Yeah, guys. This this the one. This the one. This album is nice, guys. This album is really nice right here, man. Not a single skip, man. Maybe that little interlude part, but that, then that's the interlude. So I'm gonna let it rock out, man. I'm gonna put this album in. I'm gonna press play. I'm gonna let this bad boy rock out right here, man. This is a great album right here, man. What I like the most about this album is the lead singer, guys. I like the rest you broke your rest. Yeah, it's a red dress, man. Whoa, like a grown man, man. I like that grown man talk right there man that boy sound i believe him i believe him whatever he's doing right there and you know guys i like the groove i like the vroom, 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 songs transition into one another where it all sounded like you one song but you, you realize that four songs had gone by and you just i don't know which song i'm on uh, and that makes for a great album experience you guys when when albums do that stuff right there when they don't do that whole verse hook verse hook here comes the third act solo stuff verse hook verse hook here come the third act you know and they stopped doing that this album didn't do that, man. And for that reason, this is a fantastic album. And I just love when albums do that. And they give me that good album experience right there, man. So, yeah, man. Absolutely love this thing. You guys saw my reaction to this thing. Loved it. Just my thoughts, man. Till next time.